she's kind of sweeping the ball. It's all she did was change her ball position. My name's Roxanne, and I've been playing for about eight years, and I'm 11 years old. And I score around a plus six, and my pros is my driver. I can hit my driver straight, and my cons are that my nine iron, I hit it on top. And I would like to learn how not to hit it on top. Hi, Roxy. Hi. <laughs> I'm Coach Ted. Today, we're going to look at uh, Roxy's golf swing. She's been playing golf since she was two years old, and she's been one of my uh, longest students. And today, we're going to work on a few things. I think she has a problem with kind of uh, hitting top of the ball. So today, we're going to work on staying down on the ball and going through the ball. So let me see one more swing to school. So what she's going through right now, she's kind of sweeping the ball. So she's not really hitting down on the ball so what Roxy is trying to say is that she's kind of just clipping the ball like, like picking the ball okay so if you look at the front view from the setup your, her ball position is too far left when you have a nine iron ball position too far left it's almost it's, it's really hard to really compress the ball you almost gotta hit like a wood and pick the ball so it's forcing her set up it's forcing her to take it back and just pick the ball. Good. Let's get a ball. So right there, that's her ball position before. Let's take it to the center. Ball position more in the middle. There you go. There you go. That's when the ball position is in the middle. That should be a proper nine iron ball position. For the old video, she had the ball position way too far left. So it was hard for her to really compress the ball when the ball position was left with a nine iron. Let's go to the live view. So this is gonna be her new ball position right there. I recommend pitching wedge, nine iron, all the wedges in the middle of the stance. Let's go. There you go. There you go, much better. Notice that ball's starting to fly a little further and she's hitting down on the ball more. It's not because she changed her swing is all she did was change her ball position. So a lot of the kids, what they do is, they have the ball position, driver, nine iron, short iron, all on the left side. A lot of younger kids do that. But the thing is, every ball position has to be different. Okay, let's go again. More in the middle, a little more, live view. A little more, there you go, there you go. Much better. So if you look at it, now, the ball is going to be starting a little more right on the target. So she technically she didn't change her path. Her path is going to be still the same, but just by changing her ball position, she, now she's able to hit down on the ball and get the ball starting more right on the target and draw the ball. So if you look at uh, her first swing, uh, how the ball starts left, actually swing was better. But because strictly because she had the ball position left, the ball was starting left of the target. Now her last swing, how the ball starts right on the target and draws the ball because the only thing she actually changed was the ball push and she brought it back more center. When I like work with the younger kids, I recommend uh, like a ruler or stick. And not just a stick to for the alignment, for ball push. So I would put it like, so first stick, I will get it here. And for her nine iron, I'll put it in the center and making sure that her ball push is always correct. A lot of people, they just focus on the alignment, but ball push is more important than anything. Nice. Good swing, Roxy. 